Toxicity with ibuprofen overdose is unlikely if the ingested amount is less than 100 mg per kg, however more likely if it's around the range of 400 mg per kg. Clinical features can present as mild, nausea, vomiting, epigastric pain, however, GI bleed, colitis, tinnitus, headache, and even AKI can occur. Severe toxicity has drowsiness, disorientation, nystagmus, convulsions, coma, electrolyte imbalances, metabolic acidosis, hypertension, tachycardia, and cardiac arrhythmias. So how do we manage the ibuprofen overdose? Well, we begin with the airway. Secure the airway. Consider activated charcoal, around 50 grams is for adults if presentation is within one hour of ingestion. Monitor observations, assess capillary blood glucose, carry out an ECG looking for arrhythmias, do a full blood count using these LFTs and creatine kinase. The patient must be kept in the hospital for at least four hours or eight if they have ingested a sustained release preparation. Check blood casts in symptomatic patients. Fluid resuscitation is imperative. If metabolic acidosis persists on the gas, despite correction of hypoxia and fluid resuscitation, consider the use of sodium bicarbonate. Short convulsions do not require treatment, however prolonged convulsions do. You can use IV diazepam or lorazepam. Please see the seizure video for more details. Hypertension resistant to fluid resuscitation. Refer to critical care urgently. Most often, the reason for this overdose may be an episode of self-harm. If so, please refer to psychiatry urgently. So here is a overview of the management of ibuprofen overdose. Thanks again for watching. If you do have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks again.